the things that I've been seeing in him that made me walk away from my entire life to be with him. So welcome to the So So Chanel Chronicles. Okay, so as you can see, you know, or hear, she just said that she left the whole situation for her current situation. Now, that's proof that her first marriage was fine. She just was greedy. Okay, she was greedy. She wanted her cake and eat it too, but it didn't happen that way because her mother made her tell her first husband that she was cheating. And so it's no wonder that she's going has through this, been guys. Fascinating. So I'm humbled and I'm out the way, which puts me in my own path. And I'm excited. When Bishop Jakes this morning was talking about um, grief, I feel like we spent all of 2020 grieving the marriage that we had in 2010 or 2011 or 20. Look, to all of her followers that are listening and, and looking at this video, I know you love her. We love her. That's all you say in my comments on TikTok. Look. Great. I love her too. But I'm going to tell the truth. Okay. If you really love someone, you'll tell them the truth. Okay. Who grieves their marriage? This woman is just grieving for everything. She grieves over a dollar, grieves over marriage, grieves over everything. I don't, I don't know if she's able to really decipher what to grieve about. Over 2013, she wanted this marriage, right? She left her whole life, life for in 2013, it. And it did not stop after that. So him talking about, and I had talked about that before, like when I first moved into this house, I think I talked about, I was reading a book about grief and it was, it started off talking about how you can grieve more than death. So when he went into that topic, I was just like, here we go, let's do it. And cause I still get, I still stumble on grieving over just people, just death, just the casket, just the box and going in the ground in the end. But it's the end of a lot of things, right? So our marriage ended. And we've been on the cusp of it being rebranded and rebirthed and renovated. And this is part of it. This is part of breaking up with our past. How do you rebuild the marriage? Shh. Same way you rebirth yourself. Ask for it to be saved. I asked to be saved. I asked for my marriage to be saved. I asked for my parenting to be saved. I had to ask for it to be saved. And then I had to do everything to save it. More we do do that. 